Hello guys, my name is Karagulova Mirim and I'm a teacher of Asian Medical Institute. In our institute we train doctors. That is why we mostly focus on quality of education and teach our students to be hard working and uh, to be disciplined and to, to continuously study and improve their knowledge and skills all the time because in the future they will become doctors doctors on whose decision and actions will depend people's lives the most precious thing people have their health and unfortunately doctors have no second chance and in order to make a good doctor in future our students are working hard and starting well now so let's start our Latin lesson and today we are discussing chemical nomenclature. Chemical nomenclature is a set of rules to generate systematic names for chemical compounds. The, all the requirements and uh, rules for naming chemical compounds are created and developed by International Union of Pure and Applied Chemistry and uh, in detail uh, explained and described in handbooks of IUPAC. Today we will discuss how to construct Latin names of chemical compounds. Names of organic acids. Organic acids are oxygenous acids and their names are word combinations including noun acidum, Latin base of generic name or Latin name of chemical compound with suffix eco. Look at the examples. Acidum tartaricum, acidum citricum, acidum acetyl salicylicum, acidum nicotinicum, acidum formicicum, acidum lacticum, acidum ascorbinicum, acidum carbolicum, and acidum Folicum. Vitamins, names of vitamins. Vitamin is any of a group of substances which are essential in small quantities for the normal functioning of metabolism in the body. Vitamins cannot be synthesized in the body, but they occur, naturally occur in some foods and insufficient supply of some uh, special particular vitamin can result in deficiency diseases. Altogether, there are certain vitamins. See Latin names of them. Vitamin A, retinol. Vitamin B1, thiamine. Vitamin B2, riboflavin. Vitamin B3, niacinum. Vitamin B5, acidum pantotenicum. Vitamin B6, pyridoxinum. Vitamin B7, biotinum. Vitamin B9, acidum folicum. Vitamin B12, cyanocobalaminum. Vitamin C, acidum ascorbicum. Vitamin D, calciferolum. Vitamin E, tocopherol, and last one, vitamin K, is phylloquinone. Names of acids. Names of oxygenous acids are constructed by adding uh, some certain suffixes, and these suffixes characterize the oxidation level in acid. Uh, look at the uh, examples. So the names of acids with a high oxidation level constructed with the help of word acidum, Latin name of chemical element with suffix ecum. Names of acids with a low oxidation level constructed with the help of word acidum, Latin name of chemical element plus suffix ozum. And Names of oxygen-free acids are constructed with the help of word acidum, uh, prefix hydro attached to Latin name of element 
and suffix eco. Look at the examples. Atsodum sulfuricum, sulfuric acid, high oxidation level acid. Atsodum sulfurosum, sulfurous acid, low oxidation level acid. And atsodum hydrosulfuricum, hydrosulfuric acid, oxygen free acid. Names of oxides. By international pharmacopoeia, names of oxides, peroxides, and hydroxides consist of two nouns. First, chemical element in genitivus form, and second, oxide group name in nominativus form. Look at the examples. Magnesium oxidum, magnesium oxide, magnesium peroxidum, magnesium peroxide, and hydrogeny hydroxidum, hydrogen hydroxide. So guys, today we have discussed with you uh, some requirements for constructing Latin names of chemical compounds and Latin names of vitamins. Thank you for attention. Goodbye.